Oh, this is the Scar City Studios YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And our sponsors are Alpha Claims and Hire Birmingham, the leading and best accident management company. Get a replacement car anywhere in one hour. I really appreciate you joining me today. And as I said, there's plenty of news to get through today. And there's no such thing as a slow news day. That's just the media controlling the release of information. This story comes from Newham, East London. I've covered Newham since the beginning of street news on this channel in 2018. And I've got some more news from Newham coming up later on today, which is music related news as well. So make sure you turn on your bell for notifications in relation to that. This story is about Tiz East. He's an artist coming from Newham who's actually had quite a bit of success on channels like Grime Daily. He's also featured on Pac-Man TV and has come with songs like Be Mine, Night and Casanova. He's got a lot of wifey tunes, a lot of good beats. He's got a mix of like American and some NSG type Afro beats vibes as well. I do see, I reckon he'd work well with like the likes of Lotto Boys in Birmingham, for example. And on Saturday the 20th of June, it was reported in the Metro newspaper that a man was rushed to hospital after reports of a gunshot in London. Emergency services were called to Suffolk Road near Canning Town in Newham just after 8.30pm after reports of a shooting. A trauma team air ambulance attended along with an incident response officer, a medic in a response car and also an ambulance crew. The victim suffered facial injuries but they said it was not life-threatening. He was treated at the scene before taken by road to a major trauma centre. No arrests have been made and police are investigating the incident. A London ambulance spokesperson said they were called at 8 37 on the 19th of June at Suffolk Road, Newham, E13, to the report of a shooting. They sent an incident response unit and the crew attended and took him to the hospital. A Metropolitan Police spokesman said there was called there at 8.35 to report to the sound of a gunshot. Uh, firearms officers attended the scene and the man, they say again, not seriously injured. Yesterday, Tiz East actually released images of his face and you can see that he's got a lot of, from the seat, from the looks of it, pellet damage. So this could potentially have been a shotgun that where it disperses and you can suffer a lot of injuries from that. A lot of people every week are caught in the crossfire of shotgun attacks and even closer to Birmingham in Coventry, Tree, I covered the story of Pastor Lou where he was shot in the head during a double shooting and his friend was seriously injured all the way up his back. When this was reported by the paper they said this again was not seriously injured but Pastor Lou's got a serious damage to his skull and his friend was seriously damaged on his back scarred for life so when they do say that people have not died from these injuries it doesn't mean that there's nothing uh, going on like this is still actually very serious. So I'm glad that he's okay and I'm glad that the initial reports showed that the injuries wasn't too serious but he's definitely or potentially got some scarring and this could affect him for life. And people were very quick to say that Tiz East is not actually involved in any of the current or historic beef in Newham in relation to Northside and Southside, the most notorious uh, beef that's ongoing. So I'm not sure exactly what the reasoning if he was caught in the crossfire but from the sounds of it he seems to have been very focused he's released a lot of tunes in the past couple of months and i'd really appreciate it if you go and check them out as well give it a share go and support somebody doing something legal and legit as well which i love to see so please don't forget to turn the bell on for notifications join us on facebook instagram twitter and please try and get us to a hundred thousand followers on instagram that's the target for 2020 so i'd really appreciate it if you help with that and i appreciate you joining me today peace